Hello, my name is Chatelier, and I am the host of this series. In addition to assisting each country, I'll be playing as the pirates and thus working as the agent of chaos. Uh, the pirates will have the smallest navy, and economy is uh, pretty much dependent on raiding and smuggling. I hope to stay out of the way of warring factions while reaping the benefits of the unprotected trade routes. Now, here on my YouTube channel and over at Twitch, I play a fair bit of Grand Strategy and Colony Management games, so if that's your cup of tea, you might just be in the right place. Also, make sure to check the other lovely content creators taking part in this, links are down below. But for now, it's time for Pillage and Plunder. And now that we got all that intro out of the way, let's uh, have a look at the situation currently. And unlike perhaps some other nations, we don't have. Uh, a lot of wealth. Actually, we're currently almost 2,000 in debt right now. And that's partially because we, well, we're producing a lot of maintenance supplies, which we could probably stop in a few places, save some cash. But our economy will probably be rather dependent on plundering some juicy trade routes. Because right now, I'm not sure how juicy the trade routes are going to be. I'm sure that we'll find some. Of course, uh, we'll also be doing some smuggling. Currently, we have uh, procured a deal with uh, the Dutch and uh, Ottomans for trade deals. And we do have some uh, freighters going back and forth uh, to our colonies. We have three colonies. We got Nassau, we got Palembang and Tunis. And, uh, yeah, things are not all that great uh, with the current economic situation. So we really need to try to find some ships to plunder, essentially, and then we can perhaps scrap them. But yes, that's uh, probably going to be our primary goal here. We'll try to find, uh, well, first of all, we'll do some exploration with our ships, what we have anyway, and try to find some nice places to plunder. Or at least locate the trade routes that are somewhere about, and then uh, plan for an ambush. For example, uh, the North America East Coast is over here. It's rather juicy. I'm not sure if we can actually get in a position where we would be able to spot anything, because we can't really see all that much with our ships, and we can't really stand on top of the jump point due to some uh, gentleman rules on this game. Now, of course, we are building a little bit of things, but unfortunately we don't have a huge uh, production capabilities. We're going to build another research facility, because we only have five research labs to start with, and we're currently trying to get the better gunpowder storage and then get the better sailing techniques, just so that we can make sure that our ships can keep up with speed. Of uh, course, hopefully, we'll be mostly fighting uh, commercial vessels which don't have firepower and have a low speed, which should be fairly easy to then uh, board and take back home. But anyway, yeah, that's uh, there's not a huge amount of uh, going for us right now, but I'm sure that we'll get something going on. And of course, uh, we also have uh, 10 fuel harvesters for getting rations, which means that since we are actually orbiting a gas giant, we zoom in over there, so that's where we are, and that's a gas giant which does have thorium, so we'll be able to get some rations out of that. But anyway, I will see you in a bit. We have now managed to take our fishing fleet onto the gas giant that we on Nassau is orbiting. So we should be able to get at least a little bit more fuel out of there now. We're currently, productions are not huge in our planets themselves. Well, there's actually only Tunis and Nassau that are even producing any. And But now we do have the fishing fleet, we should be doing at least a little bit. As far as I can tell, it should be producing 4.4 million, which is more than our planets combined. So that is basically where we'll get our fuel... Oh, sorry, rations in the... For the foreseeable future, anyway. Well, boys, it looks like we've found Rome. 
Unfortunately, we are only on a sloop, so we'll try to avoid it. But let's try to keep it in mind for the next time if we ever sail around here. Blimey, looks like one of our ships got sunk outside of Genoa. We've been too long without plunder, thus we're sending out a small fleet to try raiding some trade routes in the North Atlantic. It will only consist of three ships, but they will pick up some boarding parties and hopefully with the help of those we can capture some ships, which we can then bring back home and uh, scrap them from cash, for example. And there we have it, that's the end of the year now, so let's have a quick look at the situation of our nation right now. We are, of course, doing pretty bad in terms of money, because we haven't been raiding anything yet, and that's probably going to be the focus of next year, just to start getting some of the raiding going on, so that we can keep on going. And uh, I don't think we are actually building any ships, are we? Well, no, we are actually building one fourth rate and one seventh rate over there. I don't think we're building anything elsewhere, because... We don't actually have shipyards elsewhere. We're having a bit of a problem with our survey ships. They have been surveying around uh, around here somewhere. They're currently going all the way through North Pacific to American West Coast and then Panama and Caribbean to refuel, which is a little bit odd. But it might be that there's just not enough uh, to refuel from in Malacca. That might be an oversight. Also, the fact that we lost one of our survey ships in West Mediterranean, I'm not sure if I actually mentioned that during, but uh, it got sunk at Genoa. But yeah, we'll try to start raiding a bit more next year. And then if you have a look at the research, we're currently Still trying to get the better gunpowder storage, which should be done next year, and then we'll start getting the better sails, hopefully. And we might be able to increase the speed of our ships, because that's going to be useful, especially we might actually increase the speed a little bit and also increase the economic efficiency of the sails, just so that uh, we don't need as much rations to run a ship. Right, and then we're not really, we're trying to build a lot of things, but not very quickly, mostly because of our economic production modifiers, only 35%. It's probably the lowest of any nation right now. We're not losing a huge amount of money, actually. And the fact that our civilian sector is actually doing alright, or our smuggling arm is doing decently. Altogether, we have uh, seven ships. Most of which are freighters, actually, and then two colony ships, and that should bring us a decent bit of income. Uh, not immediately, but the fact that our colonies are so much spread out, the ships need to go for a long while before they reach anything, and that gives the multiplier for the profits, which is rather useful. Now, we currently have the raiding fleet moving here in North Atlantic, which is uh, going to the North Sea jump point and then returning back to Tunis to refuel and all that, because it is a bit of a long trip right now. But we hope to be able to get something out of that. We currently don't have uh, any civilian mining colonies, but that's um, fine for now anyway. And in terms of minerals, we are gaining a tiny bit of minerals, uh, but not huge amounts. And in certain areas, like uh, Tunis doesn't produce everything. It doesn't produce Venturite, so we can't actually produce troops there. And Palembang doesn't produce uh, Saurium, so there's no... Oh, right, so there's no fuel in Palembang. That would explain a thing or two. Sorry, it doesn't produce any food. Right, so... Yeah, our mineral situation is a bit of a dire thing, although... It is accumulating a fair bit right now, but that might change in the future. But in terms of current surveys we've done... A fair bit of survey at the American East Coast, and Western Mediterranean and Malacca Strait, but that's about it. I don't think we've done actually any survey elsewhere, but we have very little survey ships to be fair, and especially since we lost one in uh, Western Mediterranean, it's uh, slowed down a fair bit. On the other hand, we don't need to survey everything, 
We just need to be able to find the enemy shipping and raid that. But anyway, I think that's about it for this uh, episode. So make sure to check out my links down below in the description. And we'll be seeing you next week.